Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Welcome to Legends Nexus. I'm your host today. And we're diving into some exciting news for League of Legends fans out there. Three years ago, Jinx's saga of strife began, tearing up the lore in a big way. And now it seems like Arcane may have saved the game. We've been living with the aftermath of the Sentinels of Light event back in 2021-1, which introduced Akshan but absolutely obliterated half of the game's lore. And let me tell you, after three years of feeling like League of Legends was good, I'm not so sure anymore. But it looks like we might finally have a renewed focus on the game's lore, thanks to Arcane. Riot's been teasing their new seasonal model, and it sounds like it's going to be a real game-changer. The MOBA will now be split into three unique seasons per year, each with its own theme. These themes aren't just limited to regions. They could expand out into universes like Star Guardian, High Noon, or Project. Each season will debut a new champion from the spotlighted region. And we can expect various rift changes to reflect the overarching theme. Now. I know what you're thinking, this all sounds great, but how does it tie back into Arcane? Well, in a recent dev update, product lead Chad McCower Ballard said that in the past, riots had big releases like Swarm or Spirit of the Hearth Home that were memorable and fun, but they weren't connected to a larger, integrated moment. But with this new approach, everything will connect together. It's music to my ears, really, for three years. League has felt somewhat disjointed. This new approach is a must. And I think it takes Arcane being the catalyst for this change of mindset. We've been hoping to see Runaterra's lore reintegrated into the gameplay, and if it took Arcane to make that happen, I'm more than alright with that. The new seasonal model shines a light on all these exciting places, makes them fun and rewarding to engage with by changing up the rift and dropping new champions. There's no disparity between the new mode or character and the overarching theme anymore. Everything's wrapped up in a bow. But it's not just about looks. Season 1 forces players to players. Aggressively channeling Noxus's very essence. It's a clever spin on the region's lore, while simultaneously forcing you to change up your gameplay. The possibilities feel endless. And I think Riot's hit the nail on the head here. We'll just have to see if it can stick the landing. So there you have it folks, Arcane may be known for its bombshells, but it has reinvigorated Riot's interest in the lore that forms the building blocks of League's success. I've got my standards high now, I want to be proven wrong. For the first time since 2021, I think I just might be excited about what's coming down the pipe.